Hi, I am Harsharan and you are welcome to the class of English Grammar Lessons series of tenses. In this class, we will focus on what a tense is, its different types and further the types of these types of tenses. Let's begin. A tense is a verb form that indicates the time and state of an action. It is originated from a Latin word, tempus, which means time. As we talk about time, in present, past and future, the same way tenses are of three types, present tense, past tense and future tense. Present tense describes the things that are happening right now. For example, I study English. Past tense describes the things that have already happened. Example is, I studied English. And future tense talks about the things that are yet to happen. Example is, I will study English. Further, each type has four types. First, let's look at present tense. The four types of present tense are simple present tense, present continuous tense, present perfect tense and present perfect continuous tense. Now, simple present tense, it is the most basic tense in English. Its basic form consists of a single word like play or place. Its structure is subject plus verb and example is I play football. Present continuous tense. It combines present with the continuous aspect. Its structure is subject plus verb to be that is am, is or are plus verb plus ing. And example is I am playing football. Next is present perfect tense. It talks about past actions that are connected to present and it focuses on the result of the activity. It is formed of subject plus has or have plus past participle which is third form of the verb and example is I have played football. Present perfect continuous tense also talks about the past actions that are connected to present but it focuses on the activity itself. Its structure is subject plus has been or have been plus verb plus ing. An example is I have been playing football. The four types of past tense are simple past tense, past continuous tense, past perfect tense and past perfect continuous tense. Simple past tense is used to describe the events in the past. Its structure is subject, the second form of the verb and example is I played football. Past continuous tense refers to the past actions in progress. Its structure is subject plus was or were plus verb plus ing. An example is I was playing football. Past perfect tense is used for actions which started and finished in the past before another action which also occurred in the past. It is formed of subject plus had plus past participle which is third form of the verb and example is I had played football. Past perfect continuous tense is used for an ongoing action that started in the past and continued for some time in the past. It is formed of subject plus had been plus verb plus ing and example is I had been playing football. 
नेक्स्ट इज फ्यूचर टेंस इट्स फोर टाइप्स आर सिंपल फ्यूचर टेंस फ्यूचर कंटिन्यूस टेंस फ्यूचर परफेक्ट टेंस एंड फ्यूचर परफेक्ट कंटिन्यूस टेंस सिंपल फ्यूचर टेंस इज यूज फॉर द थिंग्स दैट हैवेंट हैपन जेट इट इज फॉर्म्ड ऑफ सब्जेक्ट प्लस विल प्लस वर्ब एंड एग्जाम्पल इज आई विल प्ले फुटबॉल फ्यूचर कंटिन्यूस टेंस इज अ कंटिन्यूस एक्शन इन प्रोग्रेस इट इज फॉर्म्ड ऑफ सब्जेक्ट प्लस विल बी प्लस वर्ब प्लस आई एन जी इट्स एग्जाम्पल इज आई विल बी प्लेइंग फुटबॉल फ्यूचर परफेक्ट टेंस रेफर्स टू एन एक्शन दैट विल हैपन बिफोर एन अदर एक्शन इन द फ्यूचर इट इज मेड अप ऑफ सब्जेक्ट प्लस विल हैव प्लस पास्ट पार्टिसिपल और थर्ड फॉर्म ऑफ द वर्ब एग्जाम्पल इज आई विल हैव प्लेड फुटबॉल फ्यूचर परफेक्ट कंटिन्यूस टेंस रिप्रजेंट्स अ कंटिन्यूस एक्शन विच विल बी डन एट अ सर्टन टाइम इन द फ्यूचर इट इज मेड अप ऑफ सब्जेक्ट प्लस विल हैव बीन प्लस वर्ब प्लस आई एन जी एंड एग्जाम्पल इज आई विल हैव बीन प्लेइंग फुटबॉल लुक एट द यूज ऑफ विल और शेल विच आर यूज इन फ्यूचर टेंस अकॉर्डिंग टू ट्रेडिशनल ब्रिटिश ग्रामर रूल शेल इज यूज विद फर्स्ट पर्सन पर नाउंस दैट इज आई एंड वी वेयर एज विल इज यूज विद second and third person pronouns that is you he she it or they but these days shall is being used less frequently than will shall is used mainly with questions expressing offers and suggestions so in this lesson while explaining future tense i have used will now you must be familiar with different types of tenses you can watch the detailed study of each type of tense by the link given above individual links of the videos of different types of tenses are given below in the description box thanks for watching we'll meet soon keep watching keep learning bye